Hello, my name is Swapna Kakani, and I'm with the Alabama Department of Public Health Office of Telehealth. Welcome to our Telehealth CART 101 training. This is a basic training to learn how to operate the CART to do telemedicine visits, telehealth visits, and video conferencing. In this training, you will learn how to turn on the CART, how to set up the camera, how to make a call to the distant provider, how to use the stethoscope, how to use the handheld camera, how to complete the patient survey and telehealth log, and finally, how to turn off the CART. Before we begin, there are some terms to know. VC, which means video conferencing, is when the CART is used for video conferencing for occasions such as staff training, in-service meetings, and external partners' use of the clinic room or telehealth equipment for non-clinical reasons. TH means telehealth, counseling, and interview encounter. This is used for non-clinical encounters with the client, such as social work visits, a diabetes educator visit, or disease intervention specialist visits. And finally, TM, which means telemedicine. This is a physician, patient, or medical care provider encounter. This is with clinical staff and the client. There are three things you should remember before turning on the cart. The first is to make sure the cart is plugged into the nearest outlet, like so. Second, to make sure that the ethernet cord coming out of the back of the cart is plugged in to the ethernet jack. Third is to make sure that the charging cradle for this camera is plugged in to the power strip on the back of the cart, like so. And now we are ready to turn on the cart. To turn on the cart, you press the red power button, switch it on, and it's located on the power strip at the bottom. Once the, you have turned on the cart, the cart should turn on automatically. D while it is booting up, take time to pull out your keyboard, pull out your mouse tray, and get ready. The top monitor and the bottom monitor will turn on. In some cases, the bottom monitor does not automatically turn on. If that is the case, please take your black remote and turn it on by using the red power button. There's also a power button on the bottom back right of this monitor. Another thing to note is that sometimes when you turn on the cart, the top monitor looks like the bottom monitor, as you can see. However, this should not happen. To correct this, you take your silver remote, point it towards the monitor, bottom monitor, press the up arrow, and you will see two icons, stop sharing and call. Press the enter button to select stop sharing. like so. This is how the two monitors should look like before beginning. And now you're ready to log on to the computer. Follow the instructions on the top monitor, control alt delete to log on, and use the username and password on the screen. Remember that the cases are sensitive. The cart is now ready to be used.